Uh, dual threat quarterback. He's one of the best players on special offense. He makes plays happen when there's no plays there to be had. So uh, we definitely have to watch out for him this week. I mean, you, every game, pretty much going back the last few weeks, you dealt with a guy who could get out of the pocket and make some things happen. Do you think that's good prep for, for Florida this week? Oh, yeah, we definitely have confidence in our defense. We showed that um, we can make plays when, when they're needed. So um, we're definitely up for the challenge. You know, he's going to be a, a great opponent this week. So we're just ready. Brian, as a secondary, you guys gave up some big plays against Oklahoma, which had a couple of picks and really kind of pushed towards the passing. Yeah. I know Georgia's probably maybe not as good as Oklahoma, but what kind of confidence do you guys take as a secondary? Uh, it's definitely a very big confidence builder. Uh, we gave up some explosive plays, like you said. That's definitely. Um, one of our goals is to eliminate explosive plays, so uh, we feel like we did a good job during the week um, preparing for that and uh, fixing our mistakes. Brian, in the fourth quarter, the defense really struggled mm -hmm. uh, to get off the field. Is that just depth kind of showing its head? What what do you factor into that? Uh, it was, I, I say it wasn't depth. Um, uh, they made plays on us, um, made some great plays. Uh, we didn't fit our gaps at times, so we, it, was, it wasn't fatigue or nothing like that. It was just uh, mental um, errors for the most part. The explosion plays, I guess, is what's sort of happening there. Is it just missed tackles? You guys oh, yeah, yeah. There was definitely, um, definitely some missed gaps. We misfit our gas and in the back end, we had a lot of missed tackles. So uh, we've been working on that so far this week, and we're trying to get it fixed. What impresses you about Florida just overall, maybe on Driscoll? Oh, yeah. Um, they have a lot of playmakers, a lot of go-to guys on um, that receiver. Uh, they're very physical. Um, they block on the edge, so you got to be prepared for the crack back and stuff like that. So it's just um, they have a lot of threats.